In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a new administrator user on your WordPress website. Hi, my name is Travis Flans with WebWorks of Kansas City. And this video, we're going to show you how to create a new administrator user on your website. Um, being that we build a lot of websites for clients or take over as their agency to to make updates to their websites, a lot of times we need brand new logins so we can actually manage the website. So this video is going to show you very quickly how to create a new user on your WordPress website with administrator privileges. So you can give that to your agency or give that to an, a new employee to manage your website. Uh, so here we are on just a very demo site that uh, we used to, to test plugins and uh, test various uh, WordPress things. So, um, so first thing you need to do from your website, here we are on the home page, um, webworks.ltd is this test website. Uh, just add a slash wp-admin, wp-admin, and this will take you to your login screen. Now from here, just log in with your credentials. And you will be taken to your WordPress dashboard. Now from your WordPress dashboard, uh, we're just going to scroll down until we find users. And then we are going to add new. All right, now you uh, are on the add new user screen. We're going to enter a username for your new user. Uh, enter their email address so they get their credentials that you're creating. Um, and I like to enter the name as well because uh, if you have some security software on your website, it may require this. So I just go ahead and enter it. And then website, you can leave this little blank. And on the user role, uh, make sure to select the drop down and select administrator. It's uh, the drop downs off the screen here on the recording, but select administrator. Uh, we want to make sure that we check mark send user notification because this will send a notification to your new user at their email address that they have a new account. Uh, now for the password, it automatically generates a long random password or you can set a password here, but Honestly, it doesn't matter because if you are sending them a notification, uh, your new user will get a link so they can create their own password. So not even you as the website owner will know the password. So uh, I'm just going to hit add new user. So we'll fire off an email to our new user at their email address with their username, uh, giving them instructions to set a new password. So here we are in our email client, Gmail in this case, and we see we've got our new uh, we've got our email with our username and password uh, sent to our new user that we've created. So he's got our username, WebWorks of KC. And now here's the link. So as the new user gets this email, they will have to click on this link to actually set their own password. Now, again, the user could set whatever password they like. It creates automatically a long random one um, that they should hopefully copy. I'm just going to leave it the, the long random password, and I'm going to hit reset password. Now uh, as the new user I've created a password and I'm going to log in. Enter the password and log in. There we go. Now I am logged in as the brand new administrator user that we created and as you can see here uh, it's got my new user's name and uh, username here as well. So the new user can now go in and edit their profile if they like. Um, usernames are not changeable by default. Um, you can do that with a special plugin. We're not going to get into that here though. Um, so there we go. That's how to create a new administrative user on your WordPress website. Thank you and have a good day.